this is breakfast. Now before I continue, I just want to point something out. The drinks were in fact different. Two packets of raspberry and three packets of lemon. Now, the other thing I've done is I've done a pretty full and accurate translation of this contents list. And in fact, it has a meal A, a meal B and a meal C, along with a list of items for each of the meals and then a list of accessories. So I have followed this pattern. So this is meal A, which is breakfast. Using the list, I created a meal B packet using the Ziploc bags that were already contained. So this is meal B, which will be lunch. And then we have meal C, which is dinner. Again, this bag came from the ration pack. Now for the sake of the video, I have decided to keep to my glasses and not use the wax cups. I will not be using the heater packet that we kept as a souvenir. So what do we get for breakfast? We get this little tin here, which is minced port and poultry, ham. It's interesting because the actual translation on the packaging, the external packaging, it has a translation here in English, Polish, English and French. And it comes out as minced port. I don't think this is minced port, I think they mean minced pork and poultry. Then we have this which is meatballs and tomato sauce. We have the honey, now I have it out here, I might try it. A lemon flavoured instant tea, a crisp bread, and I've added a coffee from the accessory pack. I've got a fresh wipe to have a clean, and then afterwards I've got a bit of gum here, I've got one of these vitamin sweets, and I've got a coffee sweet. And because I've got the meatballs, I've got some salt and pepper down here as well. Wow, that looks weird. Look at that. Very slight aroma of lemon. 250 millilitres. Right, I want to get this heated up, so I'm going to take the plastic lid off it and go and put that in a pan of boiling water. Let's move on and do the coffee. Okay, get a lot of them. <laughs> Let's move this a bit, make some room over here for these. Crisp bread, a bit like polystyrene. Melt away in your mouth. They're quite bland but not completely flavourless. Let's see what this is like. This is our pork and, and poultry ham, chicken ham. Looks good. Oh, smells divine. That's a bit too firm, so as I don't want to open the other utensils, I'll just use my home knife. Yeah, quite good texture. Quite 
quite salty. You can taste the chicken, not so much the ham, and it's delicious. Mmm. Should have wiped my hands, shouldn't I? <laughs> This is the flimsiest tissue. <laughs> Look at this. Ooh. A little bit of artificial lemon aroma coming from it. That's good. Let's try this lemon tea. Mm. That's alright. Quite sweet. Very mild lemon flavour. This is still a bit hot. Yeah, nice. It's not strong, it's mellow. There's no bitterness to it at all. Don't mind cracker in it. Hmm. That actually works. That's quite good. Oh. Well, this honey, you know, it's a bit all over the place in there. And I don't fancy getting that stickiness everywhere, so I'm not going to use that. Let me take a look at this. is quite stringy it's uh, it's like breast of chicken the texture mm. I'll take half of this out you can see the stringiness mm. it's really nice So I'm going to use the resealable lid and save that for later on and as we don't have any honey I'm going to put half of these crackers away they will be used with that meat as a snack later on Hmm. Oh, this is spreadable. Yeah, well, kind of. That's a lovely start to the day. And this is nice and light. This would be good as well with breakfast. Let's go get those meatballs. Ow, 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 that's hot. Now fortunately, because it's on my aluminium tray, the heat will go away quite quickly. The labels obviously come off in boiling. Ouch. So let's get this open and see if we can get it out onto the tray. Wow, that is hot. Ouch. Let's get these napkins open. Mmm, smells really good. Well, this is in fact one long piece of toilet roll. <laughs> a couple of pieces like that. And it's uh, got little perforations. Well, we've got four meatballs. And the plastic fork can handle them, which is good. Got a sauce here, because it's tomato sauce. Some carrots, I saw some onion in there earlier. There's some onion. I think we're going to need a spoon. Oh no, there was a spare spoon, wasn't there? Maybe that's what this is for. Hmm. Oh, it's lovely. It's herby, light tomato sauce. It tastes just like homemade tomato sauce. Mmm. They're pork. 
Mm. Quite light, quite fluffy. They break up easily, they chew easily, and they taste fantastic. Mm. Try some of this crisp bread in there. Mm. Instantly soaks it up. Great stuff. Mm. That's good on its own, you know, just with the crisp bread in it. <laughs> It's not salty at all, and it doesn't need any. It doesn't really need any pepper either. There you are, you can see the carrots, onions. Not sure what those are, might be potato. That's a lovely sauce. Looks quite compact, but it's actually quite open, it's very light. Well, of course, this is giving you a good hearty start to the day. Mmm, it's really good with this crisp bread. Of course, the thing is with it, if I take that off, what I don't want I can put back in here, seal it up, and it's good to go. Very handy. Lemon tea is nice. It's not too sweet and it's got a lovely light lemon flavour with it. It's quite refreshing. It's got nearly 400 calories in it. Try a full half of a meatball. Fantastic meatballs. Finish this coffee off. No bitterness there at all with this coffee. Nice smoky nutty flavour. Not too strong. Okay, not brilliant, but it will do. Just for these three. Haven't used the salt and pepper. Let's try the coffee. Coffee sweet. Okay, it's like a a lozenge. Hmm. It's hard boiled. Very nice. It's like a treacle chocolate flavour. Dark treacle. Hmm. Okay, that's coming out. Take too long to finish. I'll have that separately. Let's try the vitamin sweet. Well, we know what that is. It's orange, it's vitamin C, it's soft centre. I shall have that later. And then two pieces of gum. Try one of these. Mm. Spearmint. We'll finish this lemon tea off. And that was one nice Polish SRG3 breakfast. Thumbs up for that one and the containers were perfect. Arpol, continue putting your products in these containers. They work. <laughs> Please join me for uh, lunch. I think that'll be quite interesting as well. Stay safe and I'll see you on the next video. Cheers.